There's an online course which I've written and I tutor uh, called Archaeology in Practice and what we do there is basically in the course of 10 weeks bring people through a series of readings and uh, online practical activities and video clips, uh, bring them right the way from initial survey of a site, why you choose a site, the backgrounds of archaeology, right the way through to post-excavation analysis, so explaining recording techniques, excavation techniques, um, scientific analysis, interpretation and finally what happens to the artifacts after, afterwards who owns the past, how do we decide what goes in museums. So in a 10-week uh, series, um, students are, are sort of brought up to speed on what archaeology really means in the field, uh, in addition to some of the other wonderful online courses which offer more uh, chronologically specific areas of interest like the Vikings course and the Romans course. Um, and it's not impossible for those online students to actually participate in this field work because this year we've actually got two of them that have flown in from America, they've taken the online course and were so enthused by it that they've come along to dig with us here. The entry-level online archaeology courses, including Archaeology in Practice, are open to absolutely everyone, regardless of their background in archaeology. And one of the real strengths of the course is that we are a global participation. So we have students from all over the world logging on and holding conversations and sharing all their different aspects of, uh, of, of interest in archaeology and their different experiences. So absolutely no requirements for courses like that. The courses are offered termly and the website's very user-friendly. It explains uh, how you apply and what the cutoff dates are and the deadlines for, for applying. But I would encourage anyone just to visit the uh, Continuing Education website and, and follow the links to the archaeology courses. There's a wide range of them that I think are absolutely excellent.